Alright, that game, that last game got me feeling really good. Getting the guy to quit mid-home run in the top of the ninth inning, it was almost like a walk-off in an away game. But we gotta keep it going. We already know it's 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 more than crunch time right now. Giolito threw a complete game shutout in his last game. He'll be on the mound again. Hopefully he can give us another game like that. 7.30 rating, so we're still chugging. Definitely lower than I'd want to be at this point, but I'm not giving up. I can't believe it. We're on the road again. I can't play at home. We're facing Kershaw though, so he's starting a lefty. So good luck to him. This looks like it's on Hall of Fame. That's good, I wanna get used to it. I wanna keep playing on Hall of Fame. And is that gonna, no, okay. Man, I thought that was gonna get through. Wow, okay. A lot like the first inning of the last game if I remember right, but it's fine. We still got plenty of innings left to see Kershaw. I'm liking that he swung at that. And we got him swinging low. Hopefully this means this guy is a little bit of a free swinger. That'll make things a lot easier. Mm, Miss that. Okay, we might have gotten away with one pretty early here. 12-6 curve. G. Lito, two strikeouts in the first. Oh, how did that fool me? What the heck? He hits Madrigal. Interesting strategy there with two outs. Alright, something's weird with this fastball. Why am I not seeing it? Dude! Oh no, that's bad. Ooh, foul tip strikeout. I was expecting him to be way out in front of that though. I don't like that. Giolito, when I'm trying to throw the fastball up in the zone, he's missing. He's just missing with his fastball everywhere now. Rain it back in, Lucas. Come on. 12-6 gets him. And the slider gets him. As long as I keep the ball out of the zone, it seems like this guy can't really hold up. Is that going to get through? Giolito with a base hit. That, is that the first hit of the game? I think it is, yeah, because Madrigal got hit by the pitch. Oh, thank you for that, guy. I don't Wait, what's that mean? Oh, that's not gone. I don't know this stadium. All right, good. Go, wait, go. Oh, Minosa, what are you doing, buddy? He's diving back to the base on a base hit. Oh, no, 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 no. That, no. One way or another, we should have had two runs that inning. All right, Klu or Kluber. I don't have Kluber. It feels like Kluber with how many strikeouts Giolito is racking up. That'll get him. Yep, that might already be seven strikeouts. Oh, that was a good swing. That's just how it works though, isn't it? Wait, what are we doing? I might have been able to catch that, but I took an awful route. But that's always how it works. Dude can't hit, and then he, he puts a decent swing, and it just travels. But we get out of it. Eight strikeouts for Giolito in the first three innings. That is a good start. Is that not leaving? What? A perfect swing with a guy with 125 power doesn't have enough to leave? Alright, there we go. Madrigal works the walk. Not the best guy to have up, though, with it being a double play threat. Oh, I swung at ball four. Oh my god, I, I had so many chances to come through in that at bat. That's got to get down. Oh my god. Well, Giolito's got to come through. <laughs> Please. Yes! Giolito actually comes through. Oh, oh, what's happening? Oh my god, what did I just do? Oh, I'm out? I'm pretty sure I was in there. I definitely messed up, but at least we get a run coming around on Lucas Giolito. I don't know what happened out there. Like, two of his guys whiffed, so I tried to send Madrigal, and Madrigal just didn't go. Another strikeout. Oh my god. Please chase this, man. Oh, he didn't need to chase it. Finally put one in play. 
The only bad thing is Gleedo doesn't have crazy stamina, so he might only be able to go like two more. I feel like I'm outplaying this guy at every facet of the game. But I don't like the fact that I'm only up by two. Another strikeout on the 12-6. I didn't even hit the spot I wanted to. Alright, he's taking Kershaw out. That might be good. This might get him. It did. Okay. Good pitch. Oh, okay. That didn't get enough. Or that didn't get outside at all, but it still fooled him. Gagne. We see Gagne a lot, though. So we're I'm I'm fine with that. Again. I'm not kidding with putting Zach Collins in. It can't be just me. Because I'm hitting okay with everybody else, but Grandal with three strikeouts. I think this inning is going to be it for Giolito. This guy is starting to see him a little bit better, taking some pitches. And Giolito's due up next inning. Oh, the fastball up got him. Didn't even try to get it that far up. Oh, there it is. You knew it was going to happen at some point. You just time up one swing. Every every single player I play against that strikes out that much will have one swing that they time up. And they just get a massive exit velocity out of it. And Grandal should have this play made. So Giolito gets through six, gives up one, but his day is going to be over. Threw a lot of pitches, got a lot of strikeouts. Alright, well... We really might have to rely on the bullpen here because the bats have gone kind of cold. I, maybe maybe that shouldn't have been. That was so lucky. I missed the spot by so much. I know that's two strikeouts, but I am not a fan of Rob Dibble's location right now. He is not spotting up his pitches. There we go. All right. In the end, good inning out of Dibble, but... Against a lot of other players, that wouldn't have been. He's bringing in another lefty guy. Do you need me to really show you how much of a mistake this is? There, see, learn your rules. You don't bring in a lefty against this team. That felt so good, I'll be honest. <laughs> I feel like I've been gypped out of a couple of home runs today, so it was nice to get one. Yeah, I... He, he threw four straight pitches outside that at bat. I'll leave Dibble in. Hopefully this doesn't come back to bite me. Huh. That would have been pretty good comedic timing by this game. Alright, that that kind of scares me too. That's two balls that he's actually had pretty good timing on. Alright, good. Had me worried. He was like weirdly timing everything up that, that inning. Grandal narrowly avoids a four strikeout game there. I know that that swing specifically was on me for chasing it low, but it was two strikes. And I couldn't get around on the fastball, so we don't put up any more runs in the ninth, so we're going to have to hold on to a two-run lead here. And honestly, Tatis doesn't hit lefties as good as righties. Soto would be lefty-lefty, and Mookie doesn't hit lefties. I have Crochet warming up, so even though he's not at full energy, I think he's the option. There we go. I knew that would work if I spotted it. My hands are dripping right now. I don't even think I feel stressed, but my hands definitely do. And the curveball gets Soto one more. And the grounder Anderson gets there, and we pick up our second win straight. That was big. That was really big to pick up another one there. Now we're going to be solidly in the 700s. That was, that was another really fun game. I didn't hit as well as I wish I did, especially facing a lefty for, what, like seven out of the nine innings? But we still come away with the win. G Lito, another really good pitch game. I mean, not just a good pitch game. He had 14 strikeouts in six innings. All right, let's see where it puts us here, because that could be big. This guy, I mean, it was definitely on Hall of Fame, so it, it should be a decent chunk of rating here, plus 28. So we're at 758. This game, as you can see, was played on March 12th. I've been playing pretty much one game a day, 
and the plan is to keep that up for the 13th and the 14th and if I can win both those games that'll put me right around 800 which is more than okay of a place to start at for a World Series push on the last day. So the rest of the games, I mean, especially these next two games, are going to be really important. But that is going to do it for this one. If you guys like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to see if we can pull this off, because it's, it's going to be close. But I hope you guys all enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.